for nothing ear, and you get a wireless charging case and a more customized sound profile. The neat thing is that you can pair either buds with a nothing phone and set ChatGPT as your default voice assistant. Tell me about the Statue of Liberty. But that only works if you're using a nothing phone. Very cool. All right, well, family-friendly films ruled the weekend box office. Uh, the Garfield movie was actually at the top with an estimated $14 million domestically. If, which Jessica has seen, the movie about imaginary friends edged out last week's top draw, Furiosa, a Mad Max saga for second. Now, both earned over $10 million. Uh, Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes is still holding on to the top five at number four, and the movie made $8.8 million this weekend. Now, Fall Guy starring uh, Ryan Gosling, which Jessica might be a fan of, and of course the beautiful Emily Blunt. Well, that one came in at number five and making $4.2 million. Jeremiah, this is pretty cool. Good mm -hmm. stuff. Lots of money. Yeah. I'd like to hear about that. <laughs> just, just a tad. Yeah. <laughs> well, Disney's also released a movie starring Daisy Ridley. It's about a movie of a true story of Glenn Stout. She was the first woman to swim the English Channel. The movie is called Young Woman at the Sea and the Sea. Disney did not release its ticket sale for the movie just yet. Mm. Oh, suspense. Mm -hmm. uh, it's okay. Oh, and J Lo, guys. Speaking of suspense. Uh, yeah, there yikes. is some big news. Okay, uh, J Lo actually announced that she's going to be canceling her "This Is Me" tour. Mm. I know. Lo uh oh. Lopez was actually scheduled to perform at the Burt Ogden Arena in our neck of the woods uh, one month from today, uh, according to Live Nation. Lopez will be taking some time off to be with her children, family and her close friends. Uh, she had announced her tour surrounding her latest project. This is me now the greatest hits tour and Bird Ogden Arena has removed the link to purchase tickets to JLo's concert from the website. So I'm so sorry if you purchase your tickets online, you're going to be refunded automatically though. It's a good thing. Mm -hmm. uh, but if you did purchase your tickets in person using cash, you can receive a full refund starting next Monday. Oh, wow. Man, what a shame for those who really look forward to seeing I know her. that was a huge yeah. announcement that she was coming down here. I know yes. some people were excited. Mm -hmm. uh, so definitely a little bit of a bummer. But yeah. hopefully she uses the time yeah. that she needs. I'm so. pretty sure people are really wanting to know why, mm -hmm. you know, she yeah. canceled. Yeah. There's rumors saying her and Ben aren't getting along mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Yeah. But um who knows the real reason? Uh -oh. She knows, but <laughs> Jeremiah knows something I don't. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. That's we're, just what we're I'm hearing. We're gonna have to talk about this later. That's just the tea that's yeah. being spilt. Your sources, yeah. your Hollywood sources, told mm -hmm. you. Yeah. Oh. So, but man, uh, I guess she won't be coming to the valley. I know. Well, if anything, I do feel like we all need more family friend time, right? Yeah, so, that's true. I guess. if anything, I mean. Mm -hmm. Only she knows, but it's yeah. a good reason. Yeah, yeah, that's a good reason. Yeah, so. That's fair. Hopefully all everything's right. okay. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. All right, well, good morning. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Jeremiah Marshall. I'm meteorologist Jessica Kirk. And I'm your lifestyle host, Danielle Bonda. Give me one second. Hold on. It, it was here. It was. I kind of low key like it when this happens. It's, it's funny. Guys, yeah, this it's funny. Is, what happens is I always study the, the, the national day right before. Hold on. Literally, oh, give me, give me two more seconds. Out. Hold on. Just keep talking. It I know. Out. It, it was right here. Guys, this doesn't oh, just oh, happen oh, oh, with oh, the oh. national day. Of it oh. happens with everything. It's National oh. Chocolate Macaroon Day. I see <gasps> the I see the line in in the in. in Wait, my head. I love. But that's macarons. not the one I wanted to tell you. Those are my. Oh, was it? No, that's just one that came back. Jessica loves it. Fun fact. That's my favorite. Keep talking. I'm gonna remember the other one. That's my favorite dessert, you guys. And I never get them. Oh, really? They that's are your favorite? Very difficult to make. And that's, they're also yeah, very right expensive yes, if you go are. buy them. So I never buy them at the store because mm -hmm. those aren't the same. But I do have a, a family friend who oh, yes, yes, is yes, an yes. at home baker, actually in the Corpus Christi area. Yes. And uh, whenever we visit, which is probably mm -hmm. only about twice a year, mm -hmm. she brings me, uh, <laughs> she this, gives this me is some. Serious. So shout out. Uh, I love the, the, the macaroni. Ah, mm -hmm. this is the one I wanted to tell you. All right, let's get back to it. Okay. Okay. It's National Chocolate Macaroon Day. Is that the just, one? Just kidding. It's National Repeat Yourself Day. <laughs> okay. I see what you did there. <laughs> Thank you. That was nice. That that's, was nice. That's the I was one like, I wanted to do. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> did, you like, did you see how we looked at you? <laughs> yeah, yes. like I was silly. Yeah, like, did yeah. you see the way how we looked at you? <laughs> yeah, uh, see? Yeah, just your turn. following a board. It's your turn. No. no, no. <laughs> oh, I did it accidentally. Yeah. Guys, it's National Repeat Yourself Day. No, but well, the chocolate macaroons, that, those are good. My favorite is strawberry, though. <laughs> just I, I'm, disclaimer. Yes. You're okay. Hey, she repeats herself every day in the forecast lately. Yeah. Hot. Wow. Hot. <laughs> Hot. Hot. <laughs>
Jeez. Jessica, say something. <laughs> <laughs> um. Oh, what's that? A toy? I just get it back. Just get I don't, don't want to trust you guys. I don't want to press some buttons. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mess up your whole forecast. Wait. Well, <laughs> It's we, hot in here now. We are <laughs> to be uh, feeling pretty similar as we did this weekend, but today we do have a heat advisory. And this weekend, a couple of us escaped from a heat advisory. Uh, today we are going to be dealing with the heat. Feels like temperatures 108 to 115. Out there right now, we're already in the low 80s. It is 